Hello ladies and gentlemen, today I would like to explain how to stop McAfee pop-ups in Crawl. This is a common name for push notifications that appear in the system and throw people to a scam site that pretends to be the official McAfee page. In this video I will explain the dangers behind the scam, where it came from and how to stop McAfee pop-ups. Before we get started, let me ask you to press the subscribe button and leave your comment down below. That will really help my channel to grow up. Let's start with understanding what these pop-ups are and why they appear. McAfee pop-ups are the example of a scam that parasites on browser push notifications, a feature present in pretty much all modern web browsers. Fraudulent actors place redirections to their sites in different places, mainly on websites that contain pirated movies or games. Clicking on pretty much any link on such sites may throw you to the page like what you see on the screen. This should look somewhat recalling to you, as such click allow to continue pages as a very core of the scan. In this way, scammers lure the people into enabling pop-up notifications from their sites. And as soon as victim allows pop-ups to appear, the main course of the attack kicks in. Here comes the McAfee pop-ups that flood the notification tray in the matter of minutes. And that is only the one website that can send push notifications. Imagine what it will look like when several sites like that will start spamming a single system. Clicking on the pop-up opens a page in the browser that either claims your McAfee antivirus subscription expires soon and you should renew it as soon as possible, or that your system is infected with gazillion viruses and you should install the antivirus right now. But hiding behind the McAfee brand, frauds make the victim believe that what happens is a genuine notification from McAfee and urge following the guidance that most commonly leads to a payment page or a questionable origin or to the download inside of a shady antivirus tool you never heard about. Interacting with the payment form will lead to money loss and potentially to exposure of the payment information. Installing a shady antivirus, well, it is likely to show you hundreds of detections once again and then ask you to pay for fixing all this. As you may have guessed, these problems are non-existent. One more case scenario is that these pop-ups will lead you to the genuine McAfee website. This is strange as you barely expect a benign program to advertise in such a way, but maybe they are not aware about it. I'm not really sure, but... If you are willing to install their software, you'd better open the website by yourself. So, from that point, let's answer the main question. How to remove McAfee pop-ups from Chrome? As I've shown, its main part is about the permission for notifications, which may be reverted manually in the web browser interface. Go to Settings and type Notifications in the search bar. There, go for the Site Settings and in this tab, find the Notifications section. Here, you need to remove every single entry, so no sites will have permission to send notifications. However, that is not the end of the story. The appearance of the aforementioned click allow to proceed website may be an outcome of malware activity, specifically adware or browser hijackers. Moreover, the scam pages opened from the click on the notification may lead to the installation of advanced programs on their own. For that reason, I recommend scanning the system with Gridin Soft and Time Alvar. This program will easily find and remove any unwanted program and all the files related to it, and will prevent their appearance in future. Run a standard scan to check the most common places where unwanted apps store their files. After the scan, click Clean Now to remove the detected elements. I will also recommend you to reset browser settings, so there will be no leftover from the attack. You can use Gridin Soft program for that purpose as well. Go to the Tools tab, find the Reset Browser Settings and choose the browsers you need to get to the default settings. Now the system is clean. Good luck and stay safe online.